Come on, everybody. Hi. Um, so today is Wednesday. No, it's not. It's Tuesday. It's Tuesday the 14th of August. Do you know when you've got one of those days where you've got so much to do and you think, you know what, I might as well vlog it. That's one of those days. Um, so today is basically the day before I go up north. I'm going up north for two days and that's three days. I'm going up north for two days and then I'm coming back to London to move house. So a lot has changed. Um, my time is currently 24 minutes past 8. I've been up since 6 a.m. finishing a YouTube video edit, um, trying to ring estate agents, calling internet companies. It's just been crazy. But yeah, basically, I move house this Saturday, um, and that's going to be a completely separate video. This video is literally going to be me trying to sort my room up because look at the current situation. So I've got stuff all over there that's all packed up. I've got all of my plants I need to do. I've got my desk area I need to sort out. I need to sort this area. I also need to go to the gym. I need to get my hair cut. Um, pack some more boxes for downstairs. Clean. Today's just going to be a crazy day, but I thought I might as well vlog it. I've got nothing better to do. Um, so yeah, like I said, the time is currently... 25 past eight, I need to have some breakfast, head to the gym, um, and then I need to get cracking with my day because I've got a lot to do. But I hope you're all doing well, um, and yeah, let's enjoy the video. So I've just cycled back from the gym. It was another sweaty one, but there's no better feeling when you've just done like a really good session and you just feel so much more like awake. It's great. So yeah, I'm gonna have some breakfast, um, have a coffee, because I haven't had my morning coffee yet, and um, crack on with packing some boxes because I've got a lot to pack. Also, the neighbor's cat. I don't think I've introduced her on my vlog yet. This is Jules. Um, she's number seven's cat, and she's so lovely. She's a little bit old, bless her. Jules. But, um, she's just the most beautiful thing, and I'm going to miss her a lot when I move. I feel like we've really made a bond. She wouldn't really let me stroke her the first time we met her, and then now she's my best friend. I think I know what you want. We even bought some dreamies, because <laughs> we know she likes them. There we go. Good girl. I'm gonna miss you, love. I'm gonna miss you. I'm not even gonna say it, but please do just excuse this throughout the whole video. Um, yeah, I'm just, I'm just pointing and getting ready because I'm just gonna work up a sweat. I'm about to have some breakfast. Got my standard granola. I made myself a very strong coffee because I'm gonna need it. And I'm gonna go through all of the housing paperwork and call the gas electricity companies call the internet company, um, just cancel all the direct debits. I feel a little bit emotional leaving this house, I'm not gonna lie. Um, I really actually did love the house. Obviously, there was some issues, as you might or might not be aware, with my housemates, but um, yeah, I, I, I genuinely did enjoy living in this house. I had a Christmas here with my dog. It was my first time my dog came to London. It was, it was, I've had some beautiful memories, so I am a little bit emotional, but you know what, on to a new chapter, and I'm sure there's going to be many more happy memories to come in London. So, now I need to get on with destroying furniture. Um, I tried to book a charity collection, and they did take some of our furniture, although they did say some of our pieces were in an unsellable condition, so we're going to take to the local recycling because there's all wood. Um, but now I just hammer it all up, so here we go. <laughs> Seriously, a lot harder than I thought. Sorry about the music. Just a pile of wood. I'm not even halfway there.
cupboard is pretty much empty with an exception of what I'm going to have for lunch. Um, this box is nearly done. This one down here is nearly done. Um, these ones are done. I've completely dismantled all of the furniture ready to go at the tip. I've replied to some emails, I need to call the estate agent. I've rang the gas company, the electricity company, the water company and the internet company. I'm being very productive and it's only one o'clock in the afternoon. Whew. Also, there's just been a very exciting delivery that's just came through the door from Nespresso. Um, I'm gonna try and show you what I've been sent. Let me like do it in the living room because there's good light in here, bear with me. I kid you not, this feels like Christmas. They sent me two boxes, which I'm thinking are gonna be the pods. Nespresso um, do really good recycling packaging as well, which I love. Oh, amazing, so we've got a Nomad bottle, um, so this is for your coffee, just slid that out. What are these guys? Oh, I think these are the ice pods. Oh wow, so it's a shaker. Um, if you're making your iced coffees on the morning so you can like shake them up. What else have we got? We've got some Amoretti biscuits, um, which always come in handy, so fab. What have we got in here? Oh, another great big box. Let's have a look. Wow. Oh, more pods. So we've got some limited edition virtual pods. I think these are the shaken variety. Yeah, so these are the ones that you shake. I don't know if you guys can see. So they've sent me four of those to try. And also, what's this? Oh, an ice cube tray. That's really fun. Um, I'm gonna have an espresso ice cubes. How fancy is that? Oh my gosh, that's so exciting. What? What's in here? Oh, oh my god. <gasps> she sent me some Nespresso mugs. <gasps> this is insane. Oh my god. Okay, that's... I'm not going to open those because I feel like um, I just want to keep those really nice when I move. I feel so spoiled. And now this is the big one. <sighs> This is the virtual machine that they've sent me. Um, basically, the virtual machine, I don't know if you guys saw my last video, it's the new machine that Espresso have got and you can make like long black coffees because they kind of did a survey and basically people wanted them the same Espresso flavor but they wanted it in a longer drink. So, they very kindly sent me a machine to try. And it is huge. Oh, what have we got in here? Oh my goodness, what? Oh my god. Any coffee people out there, this is crazy. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13 different types of coffee. What on earth? I'm never gonna run out of coffee ever in my life. This is crazy. Wow. Get it out of the bag. Oh. What? Oh, this is amazing. Look at that. So it's the Virtual Plus, um, so it's, a, it's kind of a big machine compared to the Nespresso ones and the standard ones. However, it does make a much larger beverage, so you kind of expect it to be. Um, but um, this is just so, so crazy. Thank you so much Nespresso, this has definitely brightened up my day. Um, and I'm probably going to be on like a caffeine high for a very long time now, so amazing. Let's crack on with the move. So it's currently 20 past two. Um, we're having more estate agent drama, which is fantastic. Um, I'm gonna have some lunch because the last thing I ate was like four hours ago. Um, so I'm gonna have some soup. Um, so I'm gonna have some soup, which is from a can, how fancy. Um, and then I'm gonna tackle my bedroom. Basically, I haven't got a lot of things to do left in my bedroom. It's literally just a case of getting it all out. Uh, that's going to be the stressful thing, but apart from that, I'm nearly there. I just really want to move now, I'm kind of just getting tired of just having everything in boxes. I kind of just want to start living again and have things where I want it, but yeah, slowly getting there. So the temperature is getting warmer, <laughs> I'm kind of like sweating it out in my room, but I need to tackle my wardrobes. Basically, the whole top row is completely empty. Um, I just need to get all of my clothing out. I think I'm just going to put it in black bin liners. It's probably the only better thing to do, but... Oh my god, I'm warm. Woo! Nearly there, guys. Nearly there. to just 
dismantle my chair. Um, I've hired a moving van, but I'm not particularly confident that we're going to get everything in in one go. So, um, yeah. Not really sure if this is the right Allen key. Um, it's not the right Allen key. Well, this is very interesting. Scrap dismantling the chair. Apparently, it takes a different size Allen key to the one that um, I thought, so... Yeah, it's gonna have to move the chair as it is. So after the feel of dismantling the chair, hopefully, fingers crossed if I can remember, I now have to dismantle my desk. Um, I remember it was pretty straightforward putting it together when I got it. So fingers crossed it's gonna be pretty straightforward to dismantle it. But it's never that easy with my life. <laughs> I never want to see another screw as long as I live. Ugh. Woo! Update time. Wardrobe is completely empty. Desk is dismantled. Um, I've packed my suitcase ready to go to Durham tomorrow. I've tied all of my hangers together. I have done countless loads of laundry. Um, I'm going to show you the progress that we have now. So this is the current situation. This is my bag to take up tomorrow to Durham. Um, got some gifts in there for the parents. Got all of my hangers tied up. My desk is ready to go. All of my plants are good to go. My chair, I'm not going to dismantle. I'm hoping that's going to be okay. I've wrapped my monitor up. Those are all my clothes. And then this is just everything from my bedroom. So then the last thing I need to tackle is the gallery wall. Um, it's featured in all of my videos this year and I'm a little bit upset that it's going to go, but be sure to keep an eye out for the new gallery wall. Um, it's going to probably be bigger. And um, yeah, my new filming background for sit down videos. So let's tackle the wall. It's done. I'm really terrible at putting things on the wall. So um, I am going to come back and paint the whole of this room because obviously I want the new tenants to have a nice clean white walls like I did. So. Yeah, I need to come back and take all the nails out and paint the whole room. I'm not looking forward to it. So, it's 6 in the evening and I am absolutely knackered. I've been basically sorting, moving, breaking furniture for like a solid 8 hours now. I'm tired, I need to have some food and just relax. But um, I hope you've enjoyed the video. I think it's going to be a lot of time lapsing and a lot of um, sorting and organising if you find that interesting or enjoyable. If you did, be sure to give it a thumbs up um, and I will catch you guys very soon because the next video is going to be the moving vlog which is so exciting. Um, but yeah, be sure to subscribe and I'll catch you very soon. So bye for now.